Hey YouTube, what's up? It's your girl French Poodle 08. Okay, so as you can see, I already done this front section of my hair and it's coming out so straight. Now, I only did this front section. I didn't do some of this back area yet. But I am really liking this hair a lot better straight. So I'm going to go ahead and just straighten the whole thing and see how everything comes out. I'll be back. Okay, so I just finished straightening this wig and I'm so in love with it. Like, purple is so me right now. Like, yes, girl. Excuse me while I feel myself. Hey. Hey. Okay, so as I was straightening this hair, like, I didn't... I didn't straighten it as properly as I should have. I didn't use like a sectioning clip or anything and try to go track by track to make sure it's like perfectly silk and straight. No, I ain't have time for that. So I just grabbed my comb and just ran through it the best as I can the best as I could. Now if you look at the back, it's still a little it's still I still have a couple of you know, little crinkles back there, but we're not gonna worry about that right now. For now, we're just gonna enjoy this beautiful purple hair. This nice little purple bob that I got, yes! As you can tell, I'm overly excited about this. Like, I wish I could wear this to work tomorrow, but I cannot. So this is actually gonna be my perfect little weekend wig and I'm just in love with it. So while it was still curly, I try to wear it out and for some reason the ends, they just always kind of frayed or they'll kind of like flip up instead of like kind of bump under and that was a problem for me. So even when I straightened this hair, initially when I tried to put heat to it, my intentions were to curl it, but curling it, it wasn't working. Like this hair, it could not hold a curl. Like I turned my flat iron on all the way up to 450, still no curl. So maybe if you wanna curl this hair, you may have to put some flexi rods or some rollers in and maybe dip it in hot water or something, just like let it stay, but it does flat iron. Now, I'm pretty sure it won't go back to its crinkly state, but I really would prefer to wear it this way. And this is making me want to get some straight virgin hair now. Because usually I'll go for something curly, but yeah, straight. And now, I do need to work some more on this part. And the parting is, of course, it's not the best. I paid like... $17 for this wig, so I'm not expecting $200 quality on a $17 wig. But it is so perfect right now, and I'm about to go take a million selfies. Yes. But that's enough of me rambling for today. I will see you guys in the next video. And as you can see, I'm still playing around with this hair because I just can't get enough of it right now. This is a great $17 investment. You get a pop of color, a cute little bob. Yes. But <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Deuces.